Hey guys, anyone know where I am? Well, I mean, I'm obviously at a train station, but uh, I'm at the Tarsdale train station, which is uh, which is one stop down from where I normally am. I usually ride that far rail into the city, and we stop over there in the morning, and then I, on the way back here in the evening, I come past here and I get, or and people get dropped off here. So why am I here, you may ask? Well. I don't know if I've talked about this, but I'm meeting some people today, so we're here to actually pick up someone who's been on the vlog before, and we haven't seen yet. Or, we have seen yet. We've, he's been on the vlog before, we haven't seen him, no. We haven't seen him in a while, though. So, um, yeah, he should be arriving fairly shortly. It's rather warm today, actually. It's like 50 degrees, which is warm, so I only brought the fall jacket. It'll probably get a little bit warmer. But yeah, here's, here's a look around Tarsdale Station, I guess. It's not anywhere near as big as Cornwallis Heights, both station-wise and in terms of ridership, but, but it's here. Back to tar sale. So and back on camera. Thing? Yeah, what's, what's the half? What's what the half's good, Soroka? What's the what? What's the half's? What's happening? We just found Soroka. He's on this train. We should watch it leave. Yeah. Are you going to film it? Yeah. Well, why? How what's is the... Welsh not here? He lives here, and he's not here. Like, what? Oh, guys, it's 10 o'clock in the morning. No, it's not. It's 11.45. Well, I mean, when I called him, it was 11.45. Uh, so, I don't know. We'll, we'll figure out where he is at the moment. I was kind of mad that I didn't get a uh, Silver Liner 5. Instead, I got that I got this old one, so I was kind of sad about that. Yeah, these are kind of uh, old. Goodbye, train. So my stop would be next year if we were, um, if I was taking the train. Actually, they did have three cars open. They did? Yeah. Oh, okay, I don't know. I just went on like the first one because I don't know. <laughs> yeah, but they if they have three cars open, usually one of them is a oh, quiet. Oh, I want to tell a story about how I, how I got on that train. You guys okay. are gonna laugh. Um. That train came to my university at uh, 11.53, and my class ended at 11.50. So I had to run past like all the teachers and all the students or whatever, just to get on that train. So I go on the station, it pulls right in. I'm like, if, if my professor wouldn't have ended class by 30 seconds, I wouldn't have made it on there. So shout out to Professor Blackstone. Ooh, 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 ooh. Wait, look at this, look at this, look at this. What is, is that an Amtrak? Yeah. Ooh. That's a northeast region. It's actually kind of funny how it was like right behind mine, so that's kind of cool. Except they don't stop here. Yeah, there was Honestly, a they're kind of faster than I thought. I don't know. Uh, that was actually running kind of slow. <laughs> we found Welsh. What? I thought I found you. You know, it's nope. kind of funny. If you notice, Welsh is actually wearing a different shirt. He always wears either the Rise Against t-shirt or the Boy Scouts t-shirt. This is a Boy Scouts t-shirt. Alright, never mind. Forget everything I said. <laughs> and I thought that was something that... <laughs> uh, oh, look, it's FedEx. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Maybe they have my watch. I, I, I would hey, Soroka, do your parents own the competition to them? <laughs> Lol, FGTs. That's all I'm saying. Sure, got them. Are, are we going in or...? Yes, as we approach the scene I of the also. crime. <laughs> security systems and then he's like get the pun it's alarming <laughs> no one was laughing and then he said get the pun and then we're like doing this fake laugh ha 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 and then he just ended the lecture and he said go because someone said oh look class is over but it really wasn't we had like three minutes left i love people who do that a lot we got wawa Yes, we did. By any chance, do I look photogenic right now? No, not at all. You look kind of gay. Yeah, I hate actually. you too, bro. No, le legit, do I look photogenic right now or no? What do you mean? Like, I mean, in like a still shot, would I look good? Yeah. The best show first is... Are you... Were you filming me in the bathroom? No. Okay, good. Good. He has a hidden I have a problem with, with, with your toilet seat. Way too small. Way too small, bro. That is unacceptable. Oh, he leaked all over your seat? No, I did. Stop. No, I did. Way too small, bro. That is, 
That is unacceptable. Oh, York. In my backpack, just all the wrong, way too small. An orange That's box. That's it. Can I go in your backpack? Can I go in your backpack? So, um, we have this thing here. Welsh has some of the worst handwriting we've ever known. But we found, I found this thing on my script front a few days ago. What? You really think that that's offensive? I mean, it's true. And he knows it. Uh, but we found this thing that allows you to create handwritings, or fonts from your own handwriting. So we're going to have him do that. We need to scan it. Uh, what are those? Numbers? What's that? Uh, hold on. Let me go look. Like some kind of like hieroglyphics. Yeah, so we have this, this template. So it's, uh, one, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Or, or one two three four five six seven eight nine zero comma period semicolon colon um, two quotes near the bottom like okay. that and then two quotes near the top okay um, question mark exclamation point okay plus sign right, we'll be back once we finish this uh, we'll start we are here today with Nick and a platypus okay I'm assuming you're recording no. Are you really recording yet? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> okay, well, um, I just got a little thing in the mail. So we actually drove over to my house real quick to uh, to go unbox my bubble watch. And of course we're going to do this in my car, because what other better place would we, uh, would we do a, an unboxing like this other than, you know, straight in my car? I would say the sink or the bathtub, but, you know, that's just my personal opinion here. Ooh, nice watch. You see, that would be called a pocket knife, which is next to the steering wheel. Now it is not. Are you, are you even looking at me, or are you just staring straight at the, the knife that I just put in my compartment? <laughs> as we can see here. Dog. Anyway, as oh, I yo, you should we haven't even mentioned dog. what I have. Why is that guy walking his dog on our lawn? <laughs> what the hell? The world shall never know. That is Mike with a oh, laptop. Up, That's, I can't really see him because I'm backwards. <laughs> or he is, I don't know. And that is, of course, Nick's kneecap. Yo, Underneath you, that, we will you, like, see his popliteal arteries. Can you please film my leg? Can you I film love, my leg? I love, I love, like, filming my leg out. Now, you see, when I zoom in right here, that's his knee. And yeah. somewhere up there... Yo, can you, like, film my nipple again like you did to Nick in that one video? Remember? Well, take your nipple out and there I'll was, film it. No, 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 no. In that one video, you were like zooming in on Nick's like shirt, and you and you would talk about like the duodenum and the jejunum or whatever the hell. Juju. And you would and you would be like the duodenum is right here, and then wait, lower wait, wait, here. Go back, go, go back, the, go back. Point to the duodenum again. The duodenum is right here, I think. No. No. Where's the duodenum? Um, kind of. No, it's yours. No. Well, where's the jejunum or whatever? Next to the duodenum. Oh, okay, so the jejunum is it's here. It's approximately 11 inches from the pyloric sphincter, which is, of course, <laughs> the sphincter that connects the end of the stomach to the duodenum. I love the duodenum. So do I. It's just so important. And people people sort of, like, underestimate how cool it is. You know what else I like? What? The subclavian artery. <laughs> what is that? Oh, it's right here. It's below your clavicle. That's why it's, you know, subclavian. <laughs> yeah. How's it going? Good? Probably got mac and cheese. You want some mac and cheese? No. No, why not? Uh, uh, why do you got mac and cheese? I just want to find that. Hi, Pete. Mac and cheese. Hey. What's up? Yeah, I, I, I appreciate the French fry quality of McDonald's. I feel they're su superior to, um, Chicken pox? Yeah, I don't even eat fast food. I'm, I'm just here because of this thing. Yo, hold on. I'm gonna make a video review. All right. <clears throat> Thank you for using my, uh, my blog make... as an advertisement. No, no, I'm making a video review of the Shamrock Shake right now. You ready? You ready? Are you, are you recording? I'm ready. All right, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. It's green. It has a nice texture to it. I like it. Um, sucking on it with like a straw. I know that sounds weird, but if you zoom in on the cream, the cream is very creamy. I'm gonna be honest with you. You can't see the detail because it's all white. You can't. Oh, dang. It's all white. Whatever, you can't see it. The Back mint, to your face. The, the vanilla and mint combination is so perfect that it tastes so good. For only three dollars and nineteen pennies, you can get this delicious Mick Cafe Shamrock Shake, available for a limited time only for St. Patrick's Day, for just three nineteen, and you get vanilla and mint smoothie, all in one combo. If you. Like, let's say you can only play super strings at first. It'll start you off with that, and then once it feels you're ready for a super dotes, it'll teach you how to play dotes, and it just kicks you off as you go along. It makes you uh, actually learn how to play the song. 
Well, she said he's in bad some fall. Hello? Just kidding. I'm not oh. here. Um, <laughs> you got trolled. I love it. I love that. I love that. Well, close to you. I love that. I love that. Um, just call me again, I guess. Um, but thank you. Bye. At the tone, please record your message. When you finish recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. You don't think he's in that right now. To leave a callback number, press 5. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> wow. That is one of the best. Oh, now he's gonna. Now we can complain about that. Thanks, Pete. Did it ding? Hey, Pete. We came to Wawa and got pies. Pete, of course, had to spill his drink everywhere. Pete isn't talking. Yeah, I think we can now. What? I was walking around thinking you had the hiccups. Oh, he had the hiccups. I forgot already. <laughs> Uh, I don't know where they are. Oh, they're on the other side of the street, all the way over there. As I point the camera, did nothing. Wow. Why? Well, all my way. question is, why did they cross the street? I don't know. We told them we were at the Wayway. Yeah, but you see them? You see him in his trench coat all the way over there? Yeah, and Circus behind the pillar, of course. Oh, I'm not gonna... What are you... That is drip irrigation right there. What are you... I had to bring it up in my <laughs> He got sign. stopped with the cigarette feet. What? Why are what you, you putting that on your... Sh oh, my God. First of all, you put that on your um, shoe. That, that, that is your ice? first problem. What? Here with ice? Well, why would yeah. you? And what what is a wine punch? No. Be really. Why won't you answer me? <laughs> Bye. <laughs> 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 that is the weirdest thing I've ever heard. Like, <laughs> ever. <laughs> what did he got that message like one one day? <laughs> What's he even Pete, can you call me during class one day and just leave that message? <laughs> he can't even respond to that. Yeah. Pete, you need to call me when I'm in class next week and leave that on my voicemail. <laughs> Are you serious? Camp is pretty much rewriting uh -oh. code um, for you. Goodbye! That's all it is. Are you really? <laughs> is, that, uh, is, that, is, that, is that all that's happened to you? You're calling Sam? Pretty much, yeah. You gotta go do it again and flush the toilet. <laughs> oh my, Tom all over again. You gotta stick the phone almost out of the water and then flush it. The end of the day. Yep, it's time for the end of the day. Mm -hmm. Wait, I was finished! At the end of the day, sometimes I really wonder. Wood or really wood? Is water in the water? Where is this? Just Twilight Zone. I, I really don't know what that kid just said, but it's all ogre now. Twilight Zone. <laughs> Baby. Oh, he's not in the pool. Wait, I gotta finish off my Twilight Zone skin. Maybe some days we just don't realize it's the Twilight Zone for. Here we have a Jewish boy. He doesn't know what's going on half the time. Poke but him. Still. Poke him. What? Still. He goes to temple. Yo, what water are you just. <laughs> Yo, what? No, I wonder. Is that what the Jewish people do? Pete, hey, you want to say goodbye to everyone for the day? This has been another conclusion of the Twilight Zone. Mike, <laughs> you're not in the Twilight Zone. Get out of here. I'm <laughs> in the Twilight Zone. Where am I? You're in an alternative dimension. Peace, bros. Like the Twilight Zone? No, not the Twilight Zone, though. We're close. We're not there. Okay. We're still in the Twilight Zone. Who took my Again? Problem? Come on. I as you can see here, I'm putting my backpack on. It is waterproof. Well, I think all this shenanigans are the perfect place to end this day. Oh, Dr. Bowie. Oh, Lord. Give me a kiss and goodbye. So, goodbye, everyone, and see you tomorrow for something not nearly as exciting. <laughs>